Hi, how's it going? In this demonstration, we're going to look at another feature in Windows 7 that we can take advantage of in our .NET applications using the Windows Code Pack for .NET. Now, down here is the taskbar that is part of Windows 7. It shows you an icon for every application that you have running. Now, that in itself is nothing new. We've seen that in Windows for quite some time. But these icons are very rich. We can actually overlay them with information to give feedback back to our user. One of the ways, of, one of the things that we can do is overlay a progress bar. So that's what we'll do here. So um, we'll take a very simple example. Let's say um, in the state of our application here, when we browse, uh, we're like halfway done our application. So we'll go to the task bar. Um, the Windows Code Pack gives this to us as a static class. And we'll say the progress bar has a current value of, let's say, 50. So halfway done. And when we choose our file, let's say the taskbar, then the current value becomes 100. So it's finished. Let's run our application. It's a subtle effect, but it's a very, uh, it's a very helpful one. It's part of that rich user experience that comes with Windows 7. So nothing, no progress here now. We browse. And notice that the progress of our application uh, goes to half. So you see half that icon is colored in green. And when we select, oops, when we select, that progress fills up altogether. So you can imagine in your real application, you know, if you're doing something that requires progress, maybe you're you know, computing a backup, um, you know, parsing a file, you can use that very subtle way to report feedback back to the user. And again, it's very easy from a coding perspective. It's just a matter of using this uh, static class and accessing the progress bar property. Thank you.